At a meeting this morning of the Lee County Board of Supervisors, a local resident asked board members to move a Confederate monument located next to the old Lee County Courthouse. WTVA's Bronson Woodruff is live tonight with reaction to that request. Bronson? I'm here at the Lee County Courthouse. Right behind me here is the statue that was mentioned in today's meeting. Some local residents shared their opinions on the issue. Don't try to wipe that part of the history out. I think it's important for us to be on the right side of history. A spotlight is now on the Confederate statue at the intersection of Broadway and Court Street. At today's meeting of the Board of Supervisors, Leah David made the request today on behalf of Lee County individuals who signed a petition. She requested the board move the statue located right outside the courthouse. Board of Supervisors member Tommy Lee Ivey said over the phone that the request will be talked about in meetings to come. So I think it would be only fair that we remove all Confederate monuments along with the Confederate flag. James Lenore said he thinks this is the time for the state to make these changes, including the change to the state's flag. I think it's important for us to be on the right side of history. And I think removing the Confederate monuments, we will be on the right side of history. Tommy George said he thinks Confederate monuments are an important part of history. I don't want to see them destroyed. You need to learn from what your past mistakes are instead of just, you know, tearing everything down and like, we don't want to have nothing to do with it. Learn from it. Use it as a teaching experience. He said he would like to see it preserved. Take it, put it in a museum, put it on a Confederate graveyard. Just don't try to wipe that part of the history out because there's no... Tommy Lee Ivey of the Board of Supervisors said the request for the statue's removal is under advisement. The board's next meeting will allow those who oppose the removing the statue the opportunity to speak. Reporting in Tupelo, Bronson Woodruff for WTVA 9 News.